Cape Cast. Folks, get ready for the tastiest week on Cape Cod. Every night through Sunday, October 18th, nearly two dozen restaurants are offering special menus during the 2009 Cape Cod Restaurant Week. At prices as little as $25 for three courses, this is a great chance to try different restaurants on the cheap, even if the recession has thinned your wallet. CapeCast was lucky enough to stop by Cafe Trevi in the Mashpee Commons yesterday, where Chef Jamie Spencer cooked us up some dishes from their special menu. Folks, the first thing I'm going to prepare for you is a uh, traditional appetizer from Greece called Kefalatori Saganaki, which is basically a fried cheese with uh, an anise flavored uh, liquor. All right, so we have this Kefalatiri here, which is a sheep and goat's milk cheese. It's, it's a hard cheese. If you can't get a hold of that, you could always use uh, aged provolone of some sort. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just slice a quarter inch thick slice. Next, I'm going to put the cheese in the flour here. And then into the egg mixture. back into the flour. Now we take a small saute pan here. And we add about a one ounce of extra virgin olive oil. And then we will add the cheese that we battered. And let it go for about a minute on each side. All right, and here's the fun part. Take some of this anise flavored ouzo, which is a traditional Greek liqueur. I'm gonna move it a little bit away from the flame. And then we uh, oompa. Got some fire. And this just about finishes the dish. I'm gonna garnish with a lemon wedge and some fresh parsley. This is our second course option, which is braised short rib with Parmesan risotto and a mushroom jus. This beef's been braised for four hours in um, our own stock that we've made previously. Uh, while we finish up the braised short rib, uh, we just have to reduce it down to make the mushroom jus. I'm gonna start with the Parmesan risotto. A small saute pan, some chicken stock. Then we add our risotto. You always want to use a wooden spoon when you're cooking risotto to ensure that the starches come out of the rice. The next step to finish the risotto will be to add some fresh Parmesan Reggiano. Reggiano. And maybe a little more. Stir that in. After you incorporate the cheese, we'll add some fresh herbs. Maybe some, this is parsley and chervil. And last but not least, we always finish risotto with some unsalted butter. Next step to finish the short rib, we have the braising jus that's reducing down right now. It's almost there. We're gonna add some of these button mushrooms. 
and a few roasted portobello mushrooms. So while this finishes reducing, we'll grab our risotto and a plate. Put our Parmesan risotto in the center. Back to the rib, place that in the center. A couple mushrooms on top. A little bit of the braising jus. A little bit more fresh herbs to garnish. And that's it. Okay, to finish off your restaurant week experience, you can end your dinner with a pumpkin creme brulee. It's a uh, simple pumpkin custard with brulee sugar in the raw. Sprinkle the sugar on top. This will create a crispy sugar crust. So those are three of the ten options we have for restaurant week. I uh, hope to see you here at Trevi. For a complete list of participating restaurants, prices and menus, visit capecodwineanddine.com. CapeCast!